What's happening, people? This is Cal Alcan Fly with my wife Emily. Hello. And we we're about to get into episode seven of what is this? Ted Lasso. Ted Lasso. I was going to say heels. Heels. No. Like, no, not heels. Ted not Lasso. Yet. Yeah. Um. Yeah. The, this show's been really good. Mm -hmm. Um. So good, I forgot its name. It's been better than what I. What you thought it was, was going to be, be yeah. honestly, because you know me. I mean, I like shows like this, but sometimes I don't. Yeah. And uh, but I'm enjoying it. Yeah, it's yeah. it's good. I I, yeah. I think the guy that plays Roy Kent is amazing at that role. Yes. He he, plays, he might be my favorite character, even above. He Ted. plays a dick very well. He does. Um, very well. And I just recently found out he's actually a podcaster. Is he? And uh, yeah, so I've been listening to some of his podcasts. Oh, interesting. Uh, I, had, I listened to one today with Terry Hatcher, uh, mm. who played uh, Lois Lane on, yeah. uh, in the 90s Superman TV show. And uh, he also interviewed Kevin Smith. Really? Yeah. So it's oh. some good stuff. Yeah. But uh, yeah, do check out his podcast if, uh, if you haven't seen it. You can get it on Spotify. That's where I found it. And I believe it is called Movies. Let me double check. Oh, uh, no. Films to be buried with is what it's called. Films to be buried with. Oh, wow. With Brett Goldstein. Hmm. So, nice. Yeah. Check that out if you haven't seen it because it's, it's quite funny. He's, um, he's much more softly spoken. Yeah. In that than he is in the show. So hmm. it's, it's funny. But uh, we're going to jump right into this episode and uh, see what this one's all about. Please do smash a like on this video and subscribe to the channel. We would really appreciate that. And yeah, let's jump right in. Okay. You got me. And baby, I got you. I got you, babe. I got you, babe. <laughs> Let's not, uh, yeah, we won't give up on our day jobs. <laughs> Get in the funnel. Put my shoes on there. What in the world? He's so fidgety. <laughs> you know that there's something going on. Look at him, the way he's reacting. I mean, you can tell. He's trying to be funny about everything. Here, here we go. This is what we'll do. We'll go just classic like you see, like in New Yorker cartoons. <laughs> <laughs> This under here, uh, out my spine. Here, it's a little too caskety, isn't it? Okay, how about here? It's, 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 uh, a little too caskety. Probably sitting is best. No, sure. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she went for it, but finish just to yep, see. Yeah, just to see. Just to there you are. <laughs> Quite intimate here. Well, close, close quarters. You know, you know what it's like. It's like we're on an episode of The Sopranos. About all the gratuitous violence, which is oh, yeah. she's trying. Oh, that's a job. I, I yeah. think she knows how to she get does through care. people like like that. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's like oh, breathe. What I mean, what do you want to talk about? Mm -hmm. Why don't you tell me what happened the other night? Yeah, I don't want to do this. Oh. oh. Wow, he just... Oh. oh, he blew her off fast. Uh, yeah, he was out there quick. Out. Thank you, Jamie. <laughs> Lucky us, we get to be trained by the wonder kid himself. Oh. Very funny, Colin. You stand up comic now. Kind of ironic, because I sat you down at the match the other day. Oh! oh! <laughs> Oh, he's given as good as he gets oh, yeah. now. I can sit this well. Okay. Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god. Just god. To him. It's been two days. I don't know what to say. How about the truth? I'd love to meet up, but I'm worried that you can't live up to the fantasy I've created in my head. So uh. I'm going to let my insecurities keep me from possibly finding my one true love. Leslie's marriage, which is a bloody greeting card of some kind. Mm. And you and Roy are just aggravatingly perfect in every way. 
Oh, fuck you. <laughs> I don't know. It's definitely easier when we didn't work together. Mm. I just feel like we're around each other all the time. Wherever I go, it's like he's my shadow. Oh! oh my God, the hairy shadow. Oh! oh. What's going on? Why is oh. Jazz scatting? <laughs> Why is <laughs> Jazz scatting? <laughs> <laughs> I love him. He is so funny. Ready to go. Yeah. Roy or Higgins? Oh, Higgins. Oh. It's funny. You know what's funny? Roy's going to join the Diamond Dogs just so Higgins has to tell him what they were talking about. I can oh see God. that happening. <laughs> Here he goes again. Oh my God. Mm hmm. He'll get to it in his time. I'm swell. Swell's fine and dandy. How about you, Doc? <laughs> so is this your first time doing therapy? No, ma'am. My wife and I did couples therapy for a little while. How was that? Well, let's see. I'm here in London <laughs> and my wife is back in Kansas. Which is a good thing, because if she heard me referring to her as my wife still, she'd be hopping mad. How long these little chats you do take? Sessions typically last 50 minutes. Mm, okay. 50? But you charge yeah. by the hour, right? That's correct. You want the truth? I'm only interested in the truth, Ted. Because mm. I think it's bullshit. <laughs> you don't know me. We don't have history. And yet you just expect me to spill my guts about all the gory details of my life. The fights, the mistakes, my deep, dark secrets. But you ain't listening because you care about me. <clears throat> you ain't listen to me because you have to. to right. To right. You getting paid to just jot down your little notes and diagnose my tears and then what? Probably just blame it on my folks, right? I mean, you say you're only interested in the truth. And yet here you are, charging an hourly rate for only 50 minutes of work. Like I said, it's bullshit. Oh and he's out again. <laughs> well, I kind of agree, because I don't agree. Kind of. What, about therapy? Yeah. Oh. I don't I feel comfortable telling my life story to somebody I don't know. Sometimes it's easier talking to somebody you don't know. No. <sighs> it's just because I felt like you got angry at me for taking the piss yesterday. But Danny and Jamie did the same thing and you didn't get mad at them. Oh, mm. yeah, yeah. I can, yeah, no, I can explain that. Um, you see, Jamie and Danny are like Picasso and... Gauguin. Pedophiles. Artists. They're artists. And uh, Colin, you paint too, but um, your work doesn't end up in museums. It hangs at... Well, you like a painting at a Holiday Inn. You know, you don't inspire. You don't move people. You're there. You cover a book. Wow! You do the job, so... Just do the job. Right. He's being kind of a dick. Yeah, I can't tell if this is a way to push him into being better. Right. Or if it's... It's him being an asshole. Just him being an asshole. Right. They're talking about Roy. What? Grumpy old swat. But now, I agree with the grumpy part, but the other two words I'd take umbrage with. Roy is none of those things. He's perfect. And I should know because I spend every minute of every second of every hour of every day with him, right? right. Just tell him that you... Oh! Hi, babe. You're talking about me? Yes. yes. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Is it guy? Yeah. Bye. Oh, shit. Adios, muchachos. How you been? He's talking about me, yeah. Yeah. At least they were honest. Oh my god! She's gonna go off. Oh my god, see? Do you want me to read it to you? No, I know. I just want to watch my TV show and you're fucking ruining it for me! Whoa. Just need some time without you reading or turning me on or just fucking being there all the time! You don't want me to turn you on? No, I... Yes, I do. Sometimes. Just not all the time. 
Sometimes I need to be by myself. Wait, is this what you've been talking to everyone about? Yeah, but you don't care. I didn't when I thought it was the usual stuff like gossip or how much air I leave in a drain. <laughs> you, well, you've been making out to everyone like I'm following you around like a needy, clingy fucking fridge magnet. <laughs> fridge magnet. Oh, oh, oh my God. <laughs> a clingy oh, fridge magnet. This. <laughs> oh. Hey, you can watch your show now. Yeah, you want him gone? I just want, before we started, just to, um, well, basically, I just wanted to make an apology to Colin. Um, yesterday, I was a bit of a, uh, you know, uh, asshole, prick, cock, wounded butterfly, blanker. Yes, I was a cocky, prickish, wounded butterflies asshole. Um, <laughs> but I, I really am sorry. It, it won't happen again. Coach Nate, we have a gift for you. Yeah, yeah. Good thing you apologize, otherwise this should be awkward, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Wunderkind. Because of you saying that, instead of Wunderkind, which is the proper pronunciation. Wow. <laughs> it was Will's idea. <laughs> was it? Well, you know, it's a pretty awesome nickname. So. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you. Um, I mean, I did, I did say Wunderkind. But no, this is great. Thank you. It's really funny. Good thank man. you. Yeah. <laughs> so. okay, thank you. Oh. Hey Siri. Play the Roy is sorry for not understanding Keely playlist. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> how sweet. Rip them to shreds. And that, that's Phoebe's line. So I'm gonna have to give that back or I'm gonna get it in the neck. Now, you're not gonna see or hear me for at least three hours. He's getting too caught up on what people think of him. Yeah. If you ever do anything to humiliate me again, I'll make your life a fucking misery. Wow. Was that that kid? Yeah. Oh, wow. I hey. guess you'd be going to see that uh, yeah. therapist, man. Yeah. That's really going to his head, isn't it? Yeah, well, I think all he wants is recognition from his dad. Right. I, I feel that's like that's I, all but, he yeah. wants. Like, There's nothing there. No. There's no friendship. Like, his dad don't even talk to him, really. You know, he's, he Look appreciates everyone there at work, but I, I feel like anytime somebody tells him or says something negative about him, it, it's probably, in his mind, that's his dad saying right. those things. Right. Yeah. It's crazy. Wow. But I'm glad Ted's getting help. Yeah. Hopefully he can... Hopefully he's uh, having a little breakthrough. Yeah. I'm really anxious to see where that goes. Yeah. You know, what's happened in his life that's... Right. We'll see. We'll see. But uh, let us know how you guys like this episode in the comments down below. Uh, please do uh, smash a like on this video and subscribe to the channel. We would really appreciate that. And we will catch you all in episode eight. Bye, guys.